Hello students, welcome back. Today we are going to practice some more phrasal verbs and let us see how far you all are prepared for your exams. So without wasting any more time, let's just begin with the questions and check our progress in this matter. Let's begin. Question number one. Question. The troubles will dash for a few days and your options are run on run in run after run into so these are the four options and now you think what the right answer should be yes take time think and your time is over and let me tell you the answer the right answer is option one run on the troubles will run on for a few days because run on means continue yani ki lagatar so the troubles will run on for a few days means the troubles will continue for a few days shayad kuch dino tak troubles chalta rahega isiliye the right answer is run on run on means continue i repeat so i hope i have made this clear to all of you now moving on to the next question let us move on to the next question heavy rains dash the general assembly meeting and your options are put away put off cast away cast on put away is dur hata ke rakhna put off is again something uh, well let me first give all of you time to think and answer for yourself put away put off cast away cast on what do you think is the right answer i'm giving you time i'm waiting yes the right answer is put off heavy rains put off the general assembly meeting why put off because put off means postpone put off matlab postpone karna yani ki kisi cheez ko thoda time piche kar dena so heavy rains put off the general assembly meeting yani ki heavy rains ke wajah se jo general assembly meeting tha wo postpone ho gaya piche ho gaya next question it is difficult to dash the tantrums of a 2 year old and your options are put up with put up put on put up on so these are the four options that you have now you think and it's your time to think and answer for yourself put up with put up put on put up on i'm giving you time i hope all of you are thinking and trying to find out your own answers Well let me tell you the right answer now it is put up with option 1 it is difficult to put up with the tantrums of a 2 year old put up with matlab tolerate yani ki uh, tolerate karna kisi cheez ko sahan karna so it is difficult to uh, tolerate the tantrums of a 2 year old ek 2 saal ke bacche ke jo tantrums hote hain usko sahan karna sach mein bahut bahut difficult hota hai next question Rashmi dash the church before sunset. Rashmi dash the church before sunset and your options are passed on, passed by, passed up, pass off. Well, this answer past tense mein hi hoga. Ye main pehle hi bata de rahi hu. I'm telling you beforehand because the sentence is in past tense. Rashmi Rashmi dash the church before sunset. Sunset se pehle wo church क्रॉस कर गई थी नाउ इट्स योर टाइम टू थिंक एंड आंसर वॉट द राइट आंसर शुड बी वेल दिस इज योर टाइम एंड योर टर्न टू थिंक इज इट पास ऑन इज इट पास बाय इज इट पास अप पास ऑफ वेल इट इज नॉट द राइट आंसर बिकॉज इट इज नॉट एन पास टेंस येस द राइट आंसर इज पास बाय पास बाय मतलब गो अलॉन्ग साइड यानी कि साथ क्रॉस uh, कर जाना सो रश्मि पास बाय द चर्च बिफोर सनसेट सनसेट से पहले रश्मि चर्च क्रॉस कर गई थी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द कैट डैश द लिटिल माइस टायरलेसली 
and your options are ran after ran into ran on run back these are the four options that you have ran after ran into ran on run back well think an answer for yourself i'll wait i'll wait for 5 seconds the cat dashed the little mice tirelessly yes the right answer is option 1 ran after ran after means chase yani ki picha karna so the cat ran after the little mice tirelessly ran after because the sentence is in past tense to so cat tirelessly bina tired hue mice ka picha kar raha tha din bhar ran after matlab chase picha karna <coughs> next question he dash heavy debts and your options are ran back ran into pass into go on these are the four options that you have ran back piche jana ran into kisi cheez mein involve ho jana pass into ya fir go on what do you think should be the right answer well well your time is almost over and now let me tell you the right answer it is it is ran into option 2 he ran into heavy debts ran into matlab to be involved in kisi cheez mein involve ho jana jakkar jana so he ran into heavy debts wo bahut bhari udhari mein fas gaya tha isliye ran into not run into but ran into past tense to be involved in that is the right answer now slowly but steadily we move on to the next question her leadership qualities made her dash among others and your options are stood on stand out stand in stood off these are the four options that you have and now it's your time to think her leadership qualities made her dash among others now think what the right answer should be i'm waiting and i'm giving you time you have 5 seconds time to think i count 1 okay so i've already given you 5 seconds time and i hope all of you have picked up your own answers for the question I repeat the question once again her leadership qualities made her dash among others and the right answer is yes the right answer is option 2 her leadership qualities made her stand out among others option 2 her leadership qualities made her stand out among others why stand out because stand out means to be prominent yani ki kisi cheez mein special hona to uske jo leadership qualities hai uske wajah se wo dusro mein se bilkul special thi wo alag thi you stand out in a crowd matlab you are prominent in a crowd bheed mein agar tum prominent ho tum special ho to tum sabko nazar aoge that was the case with this girl and so stand out means be prominent Next question it is difficult to find people who dash others nowadays and your options again stand up stand off stand up for stand up on the four options i repeat stand up stand off stand up for stand up on and now it's your turn to think It is difficult to find people who dash others nowadays. यानी कि दूसरे लोगों को जो डिफेंड करता है जो दूसरे लोगों के लिए खड़ा होता है ऐसे लोग मिल पाना आजकल मुश्किल है It is really difficult to find people who support others who stand. Uh, well, I will not give away the answer to you all. Think, think, and think. And uh, I think I have given you time enough. and the right answer is 
स्टैंड अप फॉर स्टैंड अप फॉर मतलब डिफेंड करना किसी को बचाना किसी को सपोर्ट करना सो इट इज़ डिफिकल्ट टू फाइंड पीपल हु स्टैंड अप फॉर अदर्स नाव अडेज यानी कि दूसरे दूसरों के लिए खड़े होना दूसरों के लिए आ, लड़ाई करना ये आजकल बहुत रेयर क्वालिटी है नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द न्यू मैनेजर वुड डैश फ्रॉम टमोरो द न्यू मैनेजर वुड डैश फ्रॉम टमोरो एंड योर ऑप्शन आर गो ऑन come forth take over take down these are the four options that i give you go on come forth take over take down and i start uh, like i i give you time to think i'm starting to count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 5 so i have given you your 5 seconds and i hope all of you have answered for yourself and the right answer is option 3 take over the new manager would take over from tomorrow take over matlab accept karna kisi cheez ko accept kar lena yani ki jo new manager hai wo kal se pure responsibilities accept kar lega apne upar le lega responsibility lena that is take over and so the right answer is take over the new manager would take over from tomorrow kal se jo naya manager hai wo pura zimmedari pura responsibility le lega next question rome dash their greatest enemy boldly and your options are put up put into stood against stood for so these are the four options that i give you put up uh put up matlab i hope all of you know put up means to um, give away put into stood against stood for think what the right answer should be rome dash their greatest enemy boldly yes i'm waiting and i'm giving you time to think i hope all of you have answered now let me tell you the right answer and it is stood against yes option 3 stood against rome stood against their greatest enemy boldly why because rome uh, 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 why stood against because stood against means oppose yani ki kisi ke against mein khada hona so rome fought against their enemy isliye stood against next question one sorry The next question is they wanted to dash the matter in court and your options are talk on talk to talk about talk over these are the four options that i give you they wanted to dash the matter in court yani ki wo matter ko court mein settle karna chahte the and i repeat the options the options are talk on talk to talk about talk over now you think what the right answer could be yes it is talk over talk over means discuss so they wanted to talk over the matter in court that is they wanted to discuss the matter in court wo chahte the ki ye matter wo court mein discuss kare isliye the right answer is talk over next question dash his proposal was really difficult and your options are turn down turned up turning down turn up these are the four options that you have and now it's your time to think and answer correctly yes i repeat correctly try and answer this correctly and you have your stipulated time of 5 seconds i count for you all 1 2 3 4 5 well well i hope all of you have guessed and now let me tell you the answer it is option 3 turning down turning down his proposal was really difficult why because turning down means to reject yani ki mana kar dena to uske proposal ko reject karna bahut bahut difficult tha isliye turning down next question very few dash for the meeting owing to inclement weather conditions 
very few dash for the meeting owing to inclement weather conditions and your options are turn at turned up turn down turn to so i have given you your options and now it's your turn to think yes so i am again telling you it's your turn to think so i hope turn to is not the correct answer i believe think of the rest of the three options that you have turn at turned up turn down what do you think is the right answer yes it is turned up very few turned up for the meeting owing to inclement weather conditions because turned up means appear yani ki kahin pahunchna so bahut kam log the jo us meeting mein pahunche the because of the inclement weather next question he is dash the school and your options are working at work at act at act upon these are the four options that you have working at work at act at act upon so he is act upon the school to hona nahi chahiye it should not be the answer well i'm giving you time i i won't give out the answer like that think you have your 5 seconds time i'm counting Yes, it's almost over. And now let me tell you the answer. It is option one, working at. He is working at the school. Working at means be engaged in. It is working at and not work at. Working at है work at नहीं क्यों? Because it is in continuous tense. तो इसीलिए he is working at the school working at matlab engaged hona kahin kisi jagah pe kisi kaam pe lage rehna so he is working at the school wo school mein kaam karta hai so with this we come to the last question of the day and your question is one who dash his promise is always revered and your options are stands up stands to stand to stands off these are the four options that you have i will repeat the options for you all once again stands up stands to stand to stands off and now it's your turn again i give you 5 seconds time as usual let me count 1 2 3 4 5 well you have covered your 5 seconds time and now let me give give away the answer the right answer is stands to one who stands to his promise is always revered revered is respected or stands to matlab स्टिक टू यानी कि जो अपने किए हुए प्रोमिस से स्टिक करता है यानी कि जो उसे निभाता है उसे लोग हमेशा रिस्पेक्ट करते हैं सो वन हु स्टिक्स टू हिज प्रोमिस इज ऑलवेज रिस्पेक्टेड अपने प्रोमिस को निभाने वाले को हमेशा रिस्पेक्ट किया जाता है वेल स्टूडेंट्स विद दिस क्वेश्चन वी कम टू द एंड ऑफ दिस वीडियो I hope you all now have a fair understanding of the phrasal verbs we have discussed herein. If you have any questions, any queries, you can put them in the comment section below. We will try and come up with more such videos. Till then, happy reading. Bye bye.